Hi, welcome back. Um, I'm playing uh, Superliminal or Subliminal, whatever, whatever it's called. Uh, I think it's really good so far. I'm enjoying it. Uh, you may have seen in the f first two parts. I'm just keeping playing, man. It's pretty fun. What does this guy got to say? My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Hi, Glenn and Pierce. despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. Why do I feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? Okay. Red soda every time. All right, red soda. Uh, I didn't know this was a horror. That is scary as fuck. <sighs> Thought this was going to be a little fun puzzle game. And it became so much creepier. Wait, wait, there you go. What the hell did I buy? Um, Turn of this game changed. I hope it's Sunday. That is creepy. This game took a wild shift in mood. Is that because I went out of bounds for a little while? Okay, I can't open that. Oh. Oh. That's not okay. Die, die, die it. But perspective is a bitch. This immediately became very not okay. All right, Glenn Pierce, what do you got? Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And I'd like to talk more about the feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt I mentioned before. You feel this way because you want the kind of happy life you see all around you. And you know everyone else is enjoying. And that's exactly why we're here to help. Uh... Okay. That's... 
Mm. Oh, I'm going slower now. I hate dark spaces. That totally got me. This game's very clever. Warning, you were advised to subject yourself to explosive mental overload by descending into additional dreams but have now descended into a dream within a dream instead, disorienting yourself even further. You are responsible for failing to make this crucial distinction. I guess that's not going to work. Hmm. I can't get through here. But I can light up my way. Oh. This game is just a little fucked. That is rude. This is ingenious. I am a little bit freaked, but this is clever. I like this. And red soda. Because red soda is my friend. Oh, it's just tomato juice. 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 juice. Alright, well I have a light. Uh, oh. oh, I think I know what I need to do with you. Yeah, thought as much. Sneaky bitch. Starting to think like you. Game, I hate that. Did you know that unintentional multi-dream layering occurs in less than 1% of patients? This correlates strongly with the 99% of patients who are able to follow simple instructions from the standard orientation protocol. Okay. And I guess I'm not part of that percentage because I went my own way. Break out. I think I can. There we go. Oh, that's too big now. That's probably a better place to do it, honestly. Hmm. Let it happen, game. Let it happen. I'm not gonna stop trying. Weak! I made it all the way there. Lame. Alright, fine. I'll play your game. Come with me, Ken. My friend. Hmm. Okay. There's something more to that room. I know it. What a defeat. Fine, whatever. Mm? Loading screen? Could you not? I think I have time for more.
wanted me to do things in that room, but I didn't know what things it wanted me to do. Not really something you can bop to. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. This game. What a weirdo. Oh, I think I see. Somebody changed the music. So to change it back, you know. Attention, Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following risks of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss, both quantitative and qualitative. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects, unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways, and other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. Oh! That is interesting. What can I interact with in here? Figured that one. Why do I have a smiley face on my cursor? When did you get here? Smiley face? You're meant to belong somewhere and I don't know where. Oh, you turned back to normal. Alright, well I guess there's probably some achievement involving getting the smiley face to somewhere. Let's change the mood a bit, shall we? Oh, there was another way to get here. That's not a new way to get here, it's a way to restart. There we go. Got it. Warning. Dr. Pierce is This game is a lot of playing around spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. 
I have no subroutine to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. Yeah, this this game um, really testing my brain out and its cre level of creativity. Let's just return that. Yep, 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 yep. Hey, look at that. Anything on these benches or anything? <laughs> Let's check. Oh. I get, I get, when I get invested in a game, I, get, I like really hunker down and I focus. I get this hunch. I don't want to, oh, banana. Somebody wants a banana. Called and served. Attention, Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello, my introductions are redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help <laughs> you, but I also do not know how. Transmission ends. Or banana, how are you going to help me? Hello. Name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. To the Somnisculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Edge science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And buts, no ifs, or luck good. Huh. Trying to mess up with the words. I brought a banana with me. Okay, okay. That was weird. But I think that I think I think I did well. Oh, we're back here again. Seven AM. But that's gonna have to be for a next time.